When you're talking about big things like stars and galaxies and even the entire universe, the dominant force is the force of gravity. So quite naturally, after Einstein wrote down his general theory of relativity, his new approach to gravity, he and other physicists began to apply this new approach to the universe as a whole. And two individuals in particular, Alexander Friedman and George Lemaitre, they realized that Einstein's mathematics seemed to imply that the universe as a whole could not be static, that it had to either be stretching or contracting. Einstein said, no way. He didn't believe it. His philosophical mindset was entrenched in an earlier way of thinking, where on the largest of scales, the universe was static, eternal, unchanging. The big break happened in 1929. Edwin Hubble, using the powerful telescope at Mount Wilson Observatory, showed that the distant galaxies are all rushing away from us, establishing that space is stretching, the universe is expanding. Einstein quickly changed his tune and realized that indeed his own mathematics, he needed to trust it, his own math predicted something that had now been verified, that space is expanding. Now look, it doesn't take an Einstein to then realize that if the universe is expanding today, then if you wind the cosmic film further and further back, everything gets closer and closer together, so things should begin in a tightly compressed state, a primeval atom is what Lemaitre called it, from which the universe emerged. And this is what gives rise to the Big Bang theory. So that idea is that the universe starts small and compressed, undergoes this explosive swelling, and over time the universe cools down, and as it cools down, structures can begin to coalesce giving rise to stars and galaxies. So that's a quick version of the evolution of the universe, but the basic idea is once Einstein gave the world the general theory of relativity, applying that to the universe as a whole naturally takes us to this Big Bang version of cosmology, this Big Bang version of the origin of the universe.